Hi folks, Mr. Bob again, reporting live from, well not live when you get to see it, because i got to upload it first, from the Sheepy Hollow here. Just give you a little panoramic view, and you'll be able to see all the uh, trees, or at least a good chunk of them, starting to change color. A lot of the trees that you see are green, are softwoods, but there's still a lot of trees that haven't even started to change color yet. I'd be able to point them out for you, but uh, you won't be able to see them good enough. And there we go. Coming around. There's the apple orchard. Got to go in there and sort that thing out next. Those trees got to go next. They're ready for the fire pit. And here we are. This is one of my favorite things to do. Sit by the fire. I lit this up today. Oh, there. Let's see if I can put this somewhere where I don't have to hang on to it a damn thing. There we go. So we're fixing this place up once more. We've uh, figured out finally how to do the apples. This tree here in the center, that's done right. Well, pretty near right. You got one branch going straight up, but you can pick the ones, the other ones. These two over here, all there's left is uprights, and you can't pick them up. Or you can't pick the apples out of the trees because the freaking things are way over your head. So we're going to have to uh, see what we can do about modifying these. And this one over here so that we can actually get uh, the apples to pick. Alright, this is just too much, too beautiful for me. There we go. Let's just watch the fire. I don't know why people got to be so bloody crabby for. How come you just can't, folks can't be just plain happy? Wake up happy. Don't worry about what's coming at you for the day. Sometimes they don't even show up. These people. Anyway. This week, we were two days ago actually, on Monday, we were supposed to have the start the siding, but that guy hasn't showed up. Haven't heard a thing from him. Oh, I can hear a vehicle. Oh, he just changed gears, so he's going down the back roads. Boy, that's pretty. Whoops. Get the old thumb out of the way. Now these blocks here, those flat patio blocks, when I can get them moved, we'll put the concrete blocks on them, stick a couple of 2x4s up on them, and the treated lumber that I got that's over here, where the old, uh, uh, we have a stack of wood there the last couple of years, and we'll move them over here, get rid of them or maybe put one in the garage I'm not sure yet that way we can have some wood in the garage so on those nasty days you don't have to go out to the wood pile to get it you just go into the garage and on those good days you can go out and fill up the garage again we've uh, still waiting for this contractor to show up to get the roof on the, the little woodshed that we're making we'd be able to put a good cord and a half in there Oh, I heard the guy up that was going the other way. He turned around. He just figured out that the end of the road just quit.
and he's upset so you can hear him squealing away. He's lost. Anybody comes out to the end of our roads, if they don't keep on going through into the bush road, we know they're lost. Eh, those are nice looking apples. Anyway, just want to make sure the fire is safe before I go in. This will be burning most of the day. Apparently, we got ourselves a freaking hurricane coming. And if it was anything like 2014, that was two years ago for those that can count, can't count. Uh, oops, get the finger, okay. We had, uh, no power here. Nothing running for over 10 days. We ended up having to go on a vacation. Oh, well. That's it for now, I guess, folks. It's going to take me a long time to upload this. Love you. See you soon.